And we're back and well, we are ready now for our junior K1 bout. First one of the evening. Jamie the Haymaker Hay here with Harry Williams. Big kicks going straight in. There's going to be some big body shots put in here. A lot of pressure straight out the gate there. No headshots, but helmets on for safety in case there is a obviously glancing blows, which does happen. Nice handiwork from the pair straight away. And Ellis Wayne just jumping his way in there, but very nice roundhouses from Pringle. Yeah, Pringles, Pringle seems to be setting the shots up a little bit better, but Ellis Wayne seems to be like enjoys that stepping, he sort of steps in that leg and then he starts to go to that taekwondo style. Wayne just getting a little warning there. Good body shot from Pringle. Two in a row there. Pringle got some very nice roundhouse kicks. He's landed quite a few there on the left on the left ribs of, uh, of Wayne. That, so he's Pringle using that jab there and, and falling straight up with that right kick every time, that roundhouse. And switching it the other way now. now. He's landed some nice body shots of his own. Very, again and again from Tommy Pringle. Roundhouse kick after roundhouse kick, damaging the, the, the left ribs. As the first round comes to a close here. A very, very good round for Tommy Pringle, I think. Yeah, I'd say so. I think the, the, the bigger shots were, were definitely coming through in the better setups. But what, what I really like what Ellis Wayne was doing was he was sort of he was driving in. And he was sort of stepping in, getting right involved with, with the action. Just a little bit upset in the corner there, I think, just getting a bit of, you know, the emotions do take over, especially at a young age, is, you know, you know, you take a couple of shots and you think you're losing and you may, you may get a little bit upset, especially, like I say, at this age group. It's always hard to watch as a commentator, isn't it, to, yeah. to see a young lad upset, but do you know what, though? They're getting in there and they're doing more than 99% of the world who will not get in there and do this. Fair play to his coach as well for getting him recomposed. He's, He's turned that frown upside down and he's ready to come out for the second round, is Ellis Wayne. And it's always saying in the last fight, wasn't we, Harry, where it, we've, you've got to have that, you know, real synergy with you, with you, 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 your coach as a junior. Pringle's got to be aware of the emotional state now of Wayne. Let's go. Nico Koji, amazing with kids as well, obviously got a really good gym himself and knows exactly how to look out for these youngsters. A big good work, Flurry straight away. Good work, from Ellis Wayne. Channeling them emotions is Ellis Wayne. Yeah, he's, he's now put it on, putting Pringle on the back foot. Good work, that. Like you say, he turned that frown upside down. He's now ready to go. Getting some good shots in. It's the only problem with the uh, the shin guards. They do sometimes drop yeah, down. They ruin the momentum of sparring a lot of the time. Yeah, always, <laughs> especially with MMA sparring. I hate yeah. wearing them. Good shot there. Got big, big, heavy kicks as Pringle. Yeah, very big roundhouse kicks as well. Plants his feet and throws them very, very hard. Yeah, this is really good back and forth work. And I'd say, you know, Pringle again with the heavier shots, but Ellis Wayne really trying to put the put the pace on him. The crowd behind as well. Good front kick there to, to stop his man in his tracks. Oh, showing some signs of a... Uh, Oh, he's got a hurt knee now as, as Tommy Pringle. Yeah, he's been a bit of a limp, a bit of a... A little bit upset there. Not much, I didn't quite see whether it was... He looked like the kick. He came across. Yeah, I hope we can yeah, get I think he's, that, I think he's hurt his leg on that. And that's it, the fight's yeah. called. A very elated and, and, and Ellis the right, Wayne. The, the right thing to do there from Nico yeah. as well. Good, great, really good referee in his scene. You know, Tommy Pringle was a little bit upset there. I think he's hurt his leg from maybe one of the kicks. Is it here? Yeah, at the end of the day, they, they, they are young kids. We don't need to be seeing them walk away with, with big war wounds, you know. It's, it's all about learning at this I, level. Exactly, that's, that's exactly what it's about. And, you know, both, both kids emotional there. 
Um, you know, we've seen the emotions from, from Ellis Wayne in, in between rounds. He came out and I think he, he really, he's, he's <laughs> gone a really lit a fire on him. And he, and he came back out and he really put the pressure on, on Tommy Pringle. And now Tommy, I think he's just, he's maybe hurt his thigh. I think maybe stepping back, I'm not too sure. Got a couple of kicks and maybe he's gone over on it a little bit. I'm not exactly sure, but he was, he was already limping at this point. So it's not yeah, it yeah, only anything to do with that. Yeah, he's, he was the limp was uh, was on a little bit before. Whether it, it go a little bit earlier on that replay. Yeah, I think the longer he started to put weight on it, the more it started to uh, t to trouble him. But a big beastly pose from Ellis Wayne there. Yeah, he in must the comeback win. Really, really, really happy with that. Because like you saying, the fight was going for Tommy Pringles way until he saw that came out that second round, and Ellis Wayne really put the pressure on. Yeah, and you saw him between rounds. He was a little bit emotional himself, so to overcome that emotional battle and pick up the win for himself, it's a, it's a big moment. But fair play to Tommy Pringle as well. Fantastic little competitor. Fought really, really well. And here we go for the Ladies official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, after one minute, 12 seconds of the second round, your referee, Mr. Nico Joker, calls a stop to the fight, declaring your winner, Ellis Way. Please show your appreciation for Tommy Ringo. Great work there, and then goes into the win, win column for Ellis Wayne. And we'll be all right back with our next fight. Mohamed Adam taking on Cade Smith.